The Shalva Center in Jerusalem offers around-the-clock care to over a thousand disabled children, and both patients and staff have lost loved ones in the war. Now the IDF has designated it a National Emergency Response Center. Joining us now is the Chief Development Officer, Gaby Hirsch. Gaby, thank you for joining us this morning. This is really a, a renowned, world-renowned center for children with disabilities. Um, tell us what you do and how that mission has changed in light of what's happened in Israel over the last couple of weeks. So on a typical day here at Shalva, we would have anywhere between um, really typically up to about a thousand children, uh, babies, children and adults all coming to our center from across Israel's uh, demographic, coming from programs that see all the way through birth, adulthood, including employment and independent living. As soon as we had the outbreak of war, Shalva opened its doors. As you mentioned, we're a designated uh, national crisis response center and immediately started to bring in people who had been evacuated from the southern border. So already the day after the outbreak of war, we had hundreds of families who had come to stay in a neighboring hotel. We opened our doors to the center and they've been using our center all day, every day uh, for the entire families coming. We've set up a temporary school here for them. Uh, in addition to that, we have a group of teenage youth at risk girls who again, their center was in one of those neighboring villages their center is now actually within a military zone and they're not able to go back there for the foreseeable future. So 100 teenage youth at risk girls are here at Chalva. This is now effectively their home. Yeah. Um, what you're seeing on screen now are therapy sessions we've opened both for the children and of course for their parents of those who've been evacuated. Alongside that, as the evacuation process continues and more and more people are evacuated, potentially now also from the northern borders of the country, we are now getting ready to take up to a okay. thousand additional evacuees here at Shalva. Wow. Gaby, it is an amazing center. I just saw the images. It's beautiful. We know that disruption of services is especially hard for children with disabilities. We thank you for all that you're doing. God bless you. We thank you very much. You got it. Thank you, Gaby. I'm Steve Ducey. I'm Brian Kilney. And I'm Ainsley Earhart. And click here to subscribe to the Fox News YouTube page to catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis.